Hello everybody, are you fine? Are you ready to learn how to approximate the quotient of division by two ways, by default or by axis? Let's look together at the example to understand everything. Given 8.9 divided by 6 equals 1.483333. This answer is the quotient. Now to find the approximate value of this quotient to the nearest unit by default or by axis, you have to frame the decimal quotient to the nearest unit at first. So you are going to write this quotient in the middle and you are going to put it in between two whole numbers. You are going to look now at the unit's digit. The unit's digit is 1. So you are going to write here on the left side 1. And you will ask yourself, what comes after 1? Of course, 2, because 1 plus 1 equals 2. Now, the conclusion to find the approximate value of the decimal quotient 1.483333 to the nearest unit by default. When I say by default, you have to look at the left side. On the left side, you have the number 1. So, the answer is 1. The approximate value of the decimal quotient 1.483333 to the nearest unit by axis. When I say by axis, you have to look at the right side. And the number 2 is the answer, which is the approximate value to the nearest unit by axis. Now, to find the approximate value of the quotient to the nearest tenth by default or by axis, you have to frame the decimal quotient to the nearest tenth. So now you are going to write in the middle the decimal quotient and you are going to put it in between two decimal numbers. On the left side, you are going to write only 1.4. Why? Because you are going to look just here at the tenth digit. So you are going to write 1.4 only. Now you are going to add a tenth to 1.4. So that 1.4 plus 0.1, it's equal to 1.5. And here on the right side, you are going to write 1.5. Then the approximate value of this decimal quotient to the nearest tenth by default. When I say by default, you look at this side, at the left side. The answer is what? 1.4. Now to find the approximate value of the decimal quotient 1.483333 to the nearest tenth by excess. So you have look, to look here on the right side. The answer is what? 1.5. Now to find the approximate value of the quotient to the nearest hundredths by default or by excess, you have to frame the decimal quotient to the nearest hundredths. So you are going to write the decimal quotient in the middle and you are going to put it in between two decimal numbers. On the left side, you are going to write just 1.48. Y Because 4 is the 10th digit and 8 is the 100th digit. So you are going to write 1.48. Now you are going to add a 100th to 1.48. So that 1.48 plus 0 0.01 equals 1.49. So the answer will be 1.49. As if you are adding 1 to, 49, to 48 to get 49. Then, the approximate value of the decimal quotient 1.483333 to the nearest hundredth by default, by default, is 1.48. By axis, you look here, the answer is 1.49. Thank you very much, my lovely students. Stay home, stay safe, good luck to everyone.